Today, I'm gonna to show you the four types of emails that you need to be sending if you're using Shopify. What's up guys? Welcome to the Bay Branding channel. Everyone new, my name is Christian Pinon, one of the co-founders here at Bay Branding. We've been helping frustrated store owners since 2015 become impactful store owners through tutorials, tactics, and strategies. Let's get started. Let's get started. Let's get started. Let's get started. Number one, transactional emails. According to a 2016 study by IBM, the mean unique open rate of transactional emails is a whopping 47%. That's nearly double of that 21.6% of non-transactional emails. So these types of emails are not just expected, they're actually anticipated by your customers. Customers actually seek them out. There are a couple of examples that fall into this category order confirmation, shipping confirmation, and customer feedback. Because of the high open rate, you should consider adding upsells, discounts, maybe free shipping on your next order. Other things you can do is ask them to join your community. For example, if you have a Facebook group, hey, come and join us. During shipping confirmation emails, you can make it easy for them to track their order or even refer a friend to get some kind of discount. And the friend gets a discount too. Hey, everyone wins. These things will make your emails 10 times better and actually more profitable. Coming in at number two is promotional emails. Promo emails can include a wide variety of things. For example, a new product release, uh, time sensitive promotions, seasonal deals, Father's Day, actually, uh, Mother's Day, Christmas, Black Friday, Thanksgiving, Memorial Day, Fourth of July, Labor Day, Kwanzaa, Back to School, Easter, Cyber Monday, Hanukkah, Teacher Appreciation Week. Megan's gonna like that one. You can think of these emails as messages that you send whenever you have something newsworthy to share. So carefully consider who you send it to, when you send them, and who you send them to. You need to consider your audience. That's huge with these promotional emails. You don't wanna just blast everything all at once. You wanna be more targeted and more intentional on who you send these emails to. The most important thing to consider is the segment of that audience, right? So let's say you have a pet supply store on Shopify. Consider segmenting that audience into dog lovers, cat lovers. <laughs> Lizard lovers. I know you're out there. Pick them up, pick them up, pick them up, pick them up! Yeah. Pick them up! Yeah. Pick them up! That way you can actually send better promotional emails more tailored to those audiences. Reminder, stick around to the end of the video. I'm gonna show you our favorite email marketing apps that you need to try out. Next up, lifecycle emails. These emails are very personal and only targeted to a very, very small segment of your audience at a time. So this can include cart abandonment emails, which we made a video on that right here. You can check that out. Welcome emails, second order emails, and win back campaigns. These are all things that are very segmented. So my favorite out of all of these is the abandoned cart. These are the closest thing to a quick win in e-commerce. We actually made a video on how to set that up. So check it out. Last but not least, the fourth type of email that you need to be sending in Shopify is an ongoing newsletter, duh. A regular newsletter can help with the important task of educating your customers and telling your brand story. Customer case studies, brand stories, are all underappreciated way of staying closer to your audience and building a better connection. That way you don't have to rely on promotional emails all the time. So newsletters equals stories. As promised, some of our favorite email marketing tools to send all these types of emails that we're talking about. Obviously Shopify can actually send majority of them, but we prefer something a little bit more robust and sophisticated like ActiveCampaign, Clavillo, or if you want something more affordable, then you can just check out Mailer Lite. All right, you guys, thank you so much for watching. I wanna hear from you. Leave some comments down below. Have you done any of these email types, campaigns or whatever? Let me know, I wanna know. If you have any additional questions, also in the comments. Let me know. If you like this video, make sure that you hit that like button because that would alert the YouTube algorithm mad scientist <laughs> to show this video to more people. So do that. It really helps us out for real. Like, I don't know if the scientists are real or not, but it helps us.